Asia Cement Chairman Douglas Xu responded to the EPA's proposal to revoke the company's mining rights in Taroko National Park, saying at a shareholder meeting that Asia Cement's mining rights predated the park itself. She also caught upon the new administration to consider the needs of industrial interests as part of its future economic initiatives. At the end of last month, the new head of the Environmental Protection Administration, Li Yingyuan, displayed photos to show that excavation by cement companies was threatening Taroko National Park's natural environment. Li said he hoped to put a stop to Asia Cement's development in the park by canceling its mining rights there. I hope to stop mining in Taroko National Park by next year, 2017. I hope that the whole of society can come together and achieve consensus on this. Douglas Xu, chairman of Asia Cement, directly addressed the issue at a shareholders meeting today. How do you dare mine in a national park? We are not that underhanded. We started in 1974 or 1975, and the national park was only established 12 years later. I believe the new administration will be mature in understanding the demands of industry. Asia Cement faces other challenges aside from the potential expiration of its mining rights. A real estate market slowdown caused its combined revenues to drop to just 66.2 billion NT dollars last year, a decline of 15 percent over the previous year.